Okay, I'd like to recap the items we covered in this uh, unit. Uh, secret number one, learning how to manipulate shapes. So remember the tools that we're using is the selection tool or the black arrow. The black arrow selects everything as a whole. Then we had the white arrow, which is the direct selection tool. And this one selects parts of the shapes. So the, the direct selection tool is the tool that allows us to do the manipulation of our shapes. Then from there, we hopped on down to the pen tool and we had the add anchor point tool, the delete anchor point tool, and the anchor point tool. And this is the one that allows us to take curves and make them into corners and corners into curves. So let's go ahead and start with our rectangle. And our goal is to create a vehicle. Um, in this case, it might be a truck, it might be a car, doesn't matter, but you can see it's a side profile. You can easily identify the shapes. So the first thing I wanna do is make my shape and I need to add some anchor points. I just do not have enough anchor points to manipulate this into a vehicle. So I'm adding a group of three to the rear, a group of three to the front, and then I'm adding four anchor points on the path across the top. So four across the top, a group of three, and a group of three. From there, I can use my direct selection tool and grab these anchor points and move them to wherever I think a good position is. So down here in the bottom, these will be the beginning of the wheel wells on my vehicle. So you can kind of see I have a very rough outline of the vehicle. So the next thing I want to do is I want to go in there and use that anchor tool. And this is going to let me convert those corners into curves. And it's going to make it just a little bit more interesting and not so uh, look like it's been cut out by scissors. Okay, so here we go. I can get my white arrow. I can go in here and manipulate these shapes. Um, this bump is maybe just a little bit too much for the front of my vehicle. So I'm sloping that down. Um, I'm liking how my wheel wells are working out. So, hey, you know, there, there's kind of the profile of my vehicle. Of course, my vehicle needs some wheels. So let's go ahead and add some wheels. Here's a tip, hold the shift key down and your wheels will stay perfectly round. So there's one for the rear and it looks like I'm making a low rider. And there's a second one. I don't want to manipulate the shape. I just want to move it. So I'm using just the selection tool. Um, this one here, it looks like I got to move this point a little bit. So there we go. And then the last thing I want to do is I want to add some windows on my vehicle. And this is going to be a truck with a extended um, cab on it. So I can add two sets of windows looking a little funky. So let's go in here and do some manipulating of these shapes. And now you can see, come on. You can see the shapes. You can always use the arrow keys if you need to fine tune a movement of a shape or an anchor point. So there's a little another tip. The arrow keys on your keyboard will allow you to move those anchor points as well. Yeah, so there's my truck.